Okay, so how long does it actually take to clean out the cage from start to finish? I'm going to time myself. Push it away to get to the drop-ins. Okay, so I've wiped it and got the droppings out with the wood. Okay, so I've got out the drip droppings. I'm now going to just descale it, put a small amount in the cap. It fizzes. While I'm doing that, I can get some more droppings out. A shake, the high. These are the dry droppings, not the wet that were in the euro line. And I can pick them out. I don't need to pick out the high. Okay, the fizzing stopped. So I can agitate it with my finger. Oops, done. Wipe it out. Done. Pick out the droppings. I'm now gathering it up into a corner, picking out the high, as you can see, like this from the top, until I got just the drop ins. Not sure if you can see that. The dry, as you can hear. This is actually straw and hay, barley straw, and that's that, that's done. The whole thing has taken me, let's see, four minutes and it's thoroughly cleaned out at the bottom. Now I'm going to just go and do the water. Okay, I've got his water and um, I'll be putting that in a moment. I've fashioned a cloth. A couple of droppings that I found there. I'm just going to wipe it over that part that I did the lime scale with. As I say, if you find a drop in your knee, you can pick it out. And I'll put his water back. Done. 
and that's it. It's taken about six minutes in total. Thank you for listening.